And welcome back to Mr. Pokemon Ultra Moon Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we had a way through route. What route is this? Okay, so it's not gonna tell me. Great. This route, and uh, today we're gonna take on maybe the trial. I don't know if we're gonna take on the trial just yet. I think we might. We have a couple things to do before that. Before, if you guys are enjoying the series and you want to see more, be sure to destroy that like button. Read this video. Let's check out the team. Our team is stacked and filled out now, which is. A lot better than the situation we were in last episode, at the start of last episode. So we have Boga here, level 24. We have Dripper here, level 23. We have Pepper, level 27. Not Hap, level 22. Dragon, level 22. And Hans, level 19. So, we're gonna see exactly what's in the fossil that we picked up last episode, and we're going to see exactly what's going on with this Bloom duo on Dragon, because I'm a little bit curious. I, I don't know if it's gonna crash my game or what, but. I'm curious. Also, the Roto Lotto is here, so might as well use this while I have the chance, right? It's a it's a happiness thing. Is that a is that a happiness thing? Roto friendships. Okay, so I can I can make my Pokemon love me a little bit more. Nice. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. All right, let me talk to you. Let me get my hatchet, my fossil. Where dreams become reality. Yes, I have. Okay, okay. So he's gonna turn my root fossil into. What is it? What is it? A, yeah, it's a lily. All right, it's, it's a lily. Let me let me nickname this lily here and see what it actually is. It's a, oh, it's a Gorobus. Okay. Yo, that's actually kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. That's that's actually pretty pretty decent. I I'm not too upset with that. What am I gonna call you? Ah, I know what I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you. I'm just gonna call you, I'm just gonna call you huge. Yeah, I'm just gonna call you huge. I'm calling you huge because you, wait, 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 let me see, let me see your summary, let me see your summary real quick before you go anywhere. It has intimidate, it's holding a fresh water. Okay, interesting. Has a minus speed nature. Has base 18, wait, has 18 speed, what? I thought Gorobus was supposed to be quick, I guess not. Um, has intimidate, which is great. It's holding a fresh water, has water sport, magnitude, ingrain, and brine. Okay, interesting. Interesting. I'm gonna send you to the box though. There you go. I'll I'll take the fresh water though. I'll take the fresh water. That can come in handy. Alright, sweet! Yeah, this whole place is gonna be filled with things. Does this place ever get filled up with stuff or is that just like a pipe dream of his? Anyway, let me scoop up the totem sticker. Need to get working on um and getting my next set here. Oh, and there's an item here. Someone asked me why I didn't randomize the items, and I don't think I can. I can have another look at the program to see if that's possible, but I don't think I can. And the same goes for the TMs. I don't believe I can randomize the TMs either. So uh, let's have a look and see what's going on with Bloom Doom because I'm a little interested. Yeah, you should research the Pokemon. Because last time I didn't use the Bloom. Everyone's probably mad at me because I didn't use the Bloom Doom, but here we go. We're gonna try it. Captain Tyrone is here. Hello, Captain Tyrone. How are you doing this fine day? Tangla. Okay, I can't. I can't use Bloom Doom on a Tangla. You can't. I mean, I guess I could, just to kind of see what happens here. Should, let's, let's try Bloom, uh, let, me, let me see what happens here. Yeah, Bloom Doom is here. It look, it's so broken. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't know what's gonna happen here. Um. <laughs> you know, that, that sounds about right, actually, that. <laughs> Yeah, no, that that sounds about right. Um, yeah, okay. I don't know what I expected. I I really don't know what I expected actually. From uh, yeah, okay, okay. I I don't know what I expected. Uh, I tried to use Bloom Doom, and of course it doesn't work because why would it work? Why would it? Why would it work? Oh, that was okay. That was silly. All right. Well, I have a pure power sky drop coming in for this Tangler. Wait, this thing. This guy used an X attack. He's really going in right now. I was, I don't know, I was scared that it would like crash my game or like some nonsense would happen. Energy ball, okay, that's fine. I am, I'm literally assault vested. What are you doing to me? You're doing zero. Okay, let me brick break you to the next dimension. I can't believe you have a, I will never get over the fact that we have a pure power tornado. It's base like 200 attack, or I, I think that's how that works anyway. Has ridiculous attack. Okay, level 22. Nice. Ac oh! oh, I don't want to teach you acrobatics. Um. Yeah, I kind of do. I kind of do. 
Yeah, I do. I'm gonna have to take your item off you. I'm gonna have to take your assault vest off you now. So I, I can do the maximum damage with it, but I think it's worth it. I really think it's worth it. 100% I think it's worth it. Oh, it's an Aloli Meowth with Psychic Surge. Oh, geez. Okay. Look at you. All right. Well, that's fine. Let me go ahead and uh, brick break you. That's, let me get you out of here real quick, buddy. Yeah, you're not taking that. There's, there's no way you're not taking that. You, might, you, you gotta just go. You gotta just go, Meowth. I'm sorry. So I'm gonna take the Assault Vest off of my Tornadus because just, just having, I mean, Tornadus isn't really that bulky to begin with, but I think that having the pure power acrobatics is gonna do hella damage. Okay, let me take that. Yeah, I'm gonna take that from you. I'm gonna take that from you, buddy. I love you, but I'm afraid I can't just have you just chilling around that, you know? You get you get me, though. You get me. Okay, now there's some other trainers that can battle up here. I probably should take on all the trainers that I can, I guess. It swings all in the hips. I'll put my hips into it when I take you on. Oh! Please do, girl. Please do. Who are you? Oh, you're a dude. Okay. Uh, it's it's fine. It's fine. It's whatever, dude. What you what, what you got, dude? Swords buck. Wait, that's part normal, right? So dragon should technically be able to take this thing on, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can't believe my dragon has a minus attack nature. That's really sad. But you know what can you do? There you go. Brick break. Let's try this. Quick attack. Okay. What if you had like oh? What if you had like what, what's the ability called? Glaciate. Imagine the sword buck had glaciate. That'd be kind of wild, bro. Yeah, there you go. Hey, dragon coming in with the coming in with the finest of the work. Sawsbuck, get out of here. What's a Sawsbuck to a massive dragon monster? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Can I learn a move now, please? I need to get rid of Bloom Doom. I didn't learn a move. Damn it. It's level 24 that I learned moves, I guess. I should be using more of my Roto Boost as well, or my Roto Powers at the very least. Okay, let me go along here. Let me see. Yeah, I'm gonna fight you too. When it comes to Gold Fall Pokemon, it's all about the performance. Yeah, I like most things are actually. All about the performance. That's what it's all about. <gasps> Ooh, we balance. Yo, it's Alan. Hey, Alan, what's going on, dude? Durant. No fire type moves on this team, I don't think. I thought for a second that was shiny. I was like, what? But yeah, the trainer Pokemon have a small chance of having shiny, so uh, keep an eye out for that, anyway. I mean, I'll, I'll definitely point it out when it happens. Don't you worry. You'll, you'll hear about it from me, but actually, I'm going to go to Dripper. I want to try out this acrobat. I want to see how much this acrobatics does. We'll see if it was worth uh, taking the assault vest off. Because, you know, if you want acrobatics to do double damage, ooh, mirror shot, then you gotta have no items. All right, let's go. Let's do it, this. Let's see. Ooh, oh my god, it almost one-shot it, yes. And Duran has a pretty, ooh, Duran has a pretty bulky Pokemon to begin with. So this is pretty good. I, I'll, 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 I can, I'm happy with this. I am 100% happy with this. There you go. Get out of here, Duran. I just want to learn some moves, man. Pippa's level 28 now. Oh, level 25. The only reason I was, uh, the only reason I was keeping experience there on was Dragon Claw. Um, uh, yeah. Who needs electric terrain? Am I right? The only reason I was keeping experience there on was to train up my Ghastly. But I, I'll turn off the experience there again because we don't really need it on right now, to be perfectly honest. Let me go ahead and uh, slap that thing off right now. Before anyone gets uh, yelly at me, before anyone gets mad. Okay, turn that off, because we're a pretty good level, honestly. We don't really, we're not really desperate for that. Just getting it in the hole. It's fun because it's so difficult. Uh, ooh. It's fun because it's so, just getting it in the hole. It's fun because it's so difficult. Tell me how you really feel, dude. Just, just, tell, just tell me how you really feel, all right? Let me get in here and get myself healed up. I think it's trial time, honestly. Now, I could do some more battles. Don't really need, know if I need to do more battles. Actually, I should talk to the people in the Pokemon Center. They probably have some stuff for me. Let's see anyway. Da -na -na. Hello, friends. PC boxes, yes, wonderful. Comfey, great, I love Comfey. Just kidding, Comfey sucks. Please trade my Arbuck for your Trumbeak. Sure. I don't have one, sorry. <laughs> I don't have one. I'm sorry. I do not seem to have an Arbok for your Trumbeak. No, it's it's no. Oh, oh, your your. I I don't have a Trumbeak for your Arbok. Whatever, dude. Whatever, dude. You know what I mean. All right. Well, we have enough items to take on the trial, so I think we should be pretty good. I forgot how this trial works, so that's kind of upsetting, actually. Hello, girl. Mallow is always looking for cooking is the best. I think I like permanently fucked my voice. By the way, I like I can't do the high pitched. Voices anymore. There's a like, permanently messes up. Ah! Ah! Okay, there we go. Fixed it. 
All right. What's up, Mallow? Baby girl, what's your name? Thanks for like stopping by. Welcome to the lush jungle, the trial grounds for Mallow. You ready to get him some hot water? My child's ready for you if you're ready for it. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. You're the one who got a sparkly stone straight from Randy Savage, aren't you? Yes, actually, that is. That is me. I am him. Okay, here in the lush jungle, it's time for Mallow's trial to begin. All right, here we go. Mallow's trial. Pretty sure we just need to go around and collect the stuff, right? The Super Mellow Special. Uh, yeah, a Mago Berry, Honey, Big Root. I got you. I got you with this. Easy claps. Easy clap. Already solved. Already did this. Okay. Already, already done it. Uh, if you touch the trial ingredients and the, yes, um, I make a Mellow mess. <laughs> make a Mellow mess. Oh God. All right, let's go. I like the music for this though. This is pretty. I like, the trial music is nice. Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, I went for the middle one last time, and that was safe. I'm gonna try and get as little as little in the way of battles as possible. I wonder who I should lead off with here. Um, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking that. Honestly, Dripper looks like a really solid choice. Because Dripper is very strong, and Dripper has a wide variety of moves. Okay, so I'm gonna go for this one. I think that one is safe, but let me grab this item first. Yeah, super potion. I'm trying to, I'm trying to like call on my memory from the last time that I did this, but I'm pretty sure this one is safe. Or I might be wrong, actually. I might have been wrong. Well, uh, it's just whatever. I got it. It's, it's fine. Hey, I, I got my, yeah. Wait, what? No, 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 no. Wait, what? No, I wanted to... Do I have to get it from like two... Yeah, it's... Yeah, sure. No. I don't want to... What do you mean I want a different one? Go for look for the next ingredient? I... I okay. I would like to. Can I, can I go and look for the next ingredient? Yes. Sure. Yeah, okay. I'll be fine. <laughs> uh, oh. I'm no beta, I can take on Pokemon. Oh fuck, I messed it up, didn't I? Wait, did I mess it up? I messed it up, didn't I? Yeah, I shouldn't have gotten that one, whoops. Uh, Okay, that one's not safe, wow. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Yo, it's, cool. it's Sinclair. Hey, what's up Sinclair? What are you, how you doing, buddy? People say that Pokemon are lured in by flowers and gather around them. Watch out when you see a bunch of flowers if you don't want to be attacked. These ingredients are important for this trial, but they're also very important to the Pokemon that live in Lush Jungle. This thick club I'm gonna give to Mallow too. What's the result of serious effort on the part of my Marowak and I? Really? Okay, let me, let me poke my Rotom in the eye real quick. Okay, um... Where is the honey? Oh, wait, well, let me through here, actually. Let me through here. Hey, let me pick up this. Scooby, scooby up the item. It's grass knot. Okay, decent. I mean, that's not terrible. Okay, back through here. Um... I'm gonna pick all the ones that are like bad, aren't I? I can already tell. Where do I get honey from? Oh! Oh, which one do I want? Um, yeah, you know, I've completely forgotten about this. I'm gonna mess these all up, I can imagine. I'm gonna grab this one. I'm, I'm gonna assume that this one is safe. Yes, put the honey in the forage bag. Just like throw it in there. No container or anything, just, just throw it in there. Yeah, I know, I know. Stop talking to me, Mallow. Stop talking to me, Mallow. Damn it, what? Why am I so bad at this? Ah! I'm so terrible at this, dude. God damn it. A big root, huh? Yeah, okay, I know how to do this one. How did I do worse at this the second time than I did the first time? What's wrong with me? Okay, let me scoop this up. It's just guess. It's just a guessing game at the end of the day. I should have known that, though. Like, I should have known the answers already. Gosh darn it. Shut up, Lana, I don't wanna talk to you. Yeah, I'll pick up the big root. Let me scoop up this one. There we go. Bam. Throw it in the forage bag. Now I already got the big root from here. I can leave now. No, wait. No, 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 no. I have to get back. It's okay. I have a Tauros. I can make it back at super sonic speeds. There you go. Fantastic. There you go. No, no, no. That's going to be fine. It's going to be absolutely a okay. Well, I messed up two of them. So that's unfortunate. Yeah, see, look, they're happy. They're fine. They, they don't have any issues with that. 
All right. Tome Pokemon time. Thanks for, like, stopping by. You're welcome. Let me check the ingredients you got for me. Okay. Mago Berry. Yeah, okay. Looks like I stole a Mago Berry from someone. Oh, jeez. I'm sorry. Oh, it's actually a Weezing. Sorry I stole your berries, Weezing. Like, listen, listen. He's, he's got to chill out there, bro. He's got to chill out a little bit here, okay? Don't worry about it. I'll get your berries right back to you after this trial. Dark Aura. Whoa. This is an angry Weezing. Okay, I'm going to go for Acrobatics here. I know it's got good defense, but this should be doing a heck of a ton of damage, right? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yes. This is so good, dude. Learn Acrobatics. It has a base 110 power without an item on you. It's so good. Ah, uh, yeah, I, I went and took the berry that the Fermentus had an eye on. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Next up is Honey. Yeah, yeah, I messed that one up too, because I'm an idiot. Is it another Weezing? I can one-shot a Weezing. I don't mind Weezings. It's a Snap Mouth. I don't want to beat up a Snap Mouth or a Snapchat or a Snap Back. I'm sorry. Oh, I should have went for a Brick Break. What am I doing? Whoa, whoa, Ice Shard, whoa. Wait, why wasn't that super effective? Wait, 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 why? That should have been super effective, right? What do you have, normalize? What? That's so weird, okay, well, whatever. Whatever. We mix the honey in using the thick club Sinclair brought along. Ew, ew. Okay. Yeah, mix, mix the honey in there. Last but not least, the big roots. And no one's gonna attack me. And finally, it's finished with one last pinch of my super special secret spice. It's it's literally just her hair. She just like pulls out her hair and she puts her hair in there. It's like my super secret spice. The super mallow special. It's all done. It smells delicioso, you see also. Oh god, oh god, here here it comes. Here comes the toady. Okay. I'm a little bit worried about this, but okay. Snip snip! Please don't snip snip me. Please don't snip snip me! Oh no, it's a masquerade! Wait, I got this. Wait, what happens here? It speed rose sharply. Okay, masquerade was actually the bane of my existence in my original Nuzlocke, but we have a really good matchup here. It's level 26, oh my god, okay. Acrobatics, just, just go for it, just kill this thing. What are you doing? Beak blast? Beak blast! Kill it. Kill it, kill it, kill it. <laughs> That's the first time in any of the four playthroughs of Ultra Sun or Sun and Moon or, or Moon or whatever version of it in seventh gen, I've ever one-shotted a totem Pokemon. And I have to say, that felt good, dude. That felt super good. People are gonna be like, well, that was anticlimactic. Well, hey, what did you want me to do? Not use acrobatics to make it a challenge? Why would I do that? I mean, I was actually a little bit scared when I saw the Masquerade come up because when I played through uh, Ultra Sun the first time, Masquerade would like almost sweep my team. And literally when I played through Sun and Moon the first time, Masquerade would like oh, almost sweep my team because it got buffed in this generation. So I was actually scared of that, but I was thinking it's randomized, it doesn't have Intimidate. So the randomized abilities actually helped me there. Which is pretty good for me. And last trial, I lost three Pokemon, so... I'm happy to have a trial I could just kind of run over easy, honestly. Wow, Patter, it's even stronger than I thought. I literally just one-shot at that thing. Honestly, even if it was a Lorantis, I still would have bodied it easily. What do you mean? Uh, but the later ones are gonna get harder because they're, they're gonna start getting all of their stats boosted. And one of the trials have all of their stats boosted by two, which is the last one, which is uh, very much terrifying. Yes, Haven back at Whale of Volcano Park, my Marowak didn't stand a chance. Not at the Araquita, I trained so carefully. <laughs> this is funny for some reason, even though I killed your. I, I killed one of your Pokemon. Wait, did he kill one of my Pokemon? Yeah, he, he, one of my Pokemon died there, right? Looks like you've cleared the three of Akala's trials. An amazing trainer like you, he even cleared my super hard trial. Definitely deserves this. You think so? Thank you. It's... A glowy green thing! Yeah! Thank you! Like, yes! I got the green glowy! Nice! Mission accomplished, boys and girls. Mission 
Accomplished. We did it. We have done it. We have achieved the objective. Grass MZ. Ah, you, you go like grass. That's what you say. Uh, people might look at you a little bit weird if you go like grass. Maybe I don't know. Since you've like cleared my trial patterns, why don't you try raising some Pokemon from Lush Jungle? Here, have some nest balls. <gasps> I can get an encounter from here now. Why am I doing this? What is this? What is this? What am I, Donald Trump? No. The ranch didn't finish its food. Well, can't let it go to waste. Lana Sinclair, you guys should have some. Uh, I'm actually feeling pretty full right now. I just ate a berry. Yeah, a single berry. I have the stomach the size of a crayon, by the way. That's why I'm full from a single berry. Yeah. You think Olivia always thinks Chasey thinks she's delicious? You think? I think Pokemon would people would enjoy Fuko for a Pokemon too. You guys is lost. She's like bl smashes her head into the mix, and she's like, "Oh my god, it's so good." I looked pretty hot, actually. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't smash my head in that. Now that I think of it, <gasps> it's long schlong. Ooh, what's that sweet smell? I smell drifting. A smelly smell. It smells smelly. I hear you've cleared Malo's trial, yeah? I have a present for you. This little TM, Smart Strike. Hey, that's actually pretty helpful. I appreciate that. Thank you. I don't know if I can actually teach it to anyone, but it's still a still a cool move nonetheless. There'll be all kinds of new discoveries and new experiences to make your adventure brighter. There's a facility, yeah? I want you to go check out in your Alec challenge. The Dimensional Research Lab. Let's get on over there with extreme speed. Sure. Uh, I need to go back in the jungle, though, so... I'll I'll catch up with you later. Yeah, no, nah, I yeah I'll definitely want to yeah. I, let me go and catch some Pokemon. I know where it is, Long Shlong. I know where it is. Let me go and catch some Pokemon first though. Da -na 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 -na. All right, so our first encounter in jungle. Oh oh, it's there. It is. It's going to be a Halop. It's, it's another Grunter. It's another ground type. That's wild. That's wild. I don't. I don't. I. 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 I, I have no words. That's the third water ground type I've gotten as well. So I got Shellos, which evolves into water ground type. I have Marsh Chomp, and now I have Palapitoad. And then it's another water type. Even though I have a plentiful supply of water types too. I. 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 I, 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 I I, I don't understand this, man. I don't understand this. Okay, I'm gonna call you, um... <gasps> oh, I know what to call you. I have to call you totally. Hold on. How do I... How do I make it so it's always capital letters? Damn it, I can't. Totally. There you go. Totally. Shout out to the WBE, by the way. Shout out to the WBE. Totally, my mans. All right, I'm gonna send it to the box. It has a ghost gem. I'm gonna place it in my bag. Sure, I should have a look at your uh, summary, actually. I should definitely have a look at your. Su oh, wait, what, what's this? A citrus berry. Nice, thank you. All right, that was our encounter from Lush Jungle. Unfortunately, it's yet another water type. It's yet another ground type, which we really didn't need a whole lot of, but we got nonetheless, so we're gonna have to deal with it, I guess. Oh, it's, it's a random stag encounter? Oh, fuck this thing. Ew! Gross monkey thing! Okay, I mean, technically I could have called this, but I really don't like these guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and run away. Technically... Technically I could have called this. Um, actually, so haven't I already had a psych encounter from this? Yeah, I had the Wimpod. Wait, what route am I in right now? I don't even know, man. I don't even know. This is so dumb and complicated. Lush Jungle, Brooklyn Hill. Okay, I, I whatever, dude. Whatever, dude. I'm trying to find some items around here, you feel? Ja feel, ja 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 ja. Nope, okay. Well, let me fly back to the city then. I'm on the road to Dimensional Research Lab. I'm on my way, I'm on the road, I'm on the road. I'm on the road to Dimensional Research Lab. I'm on my way, I'm on the road, I'm on the road, I'm on the road. All right, well, oh, before I do anything else, actually, before I make a dumb, s oh, well, there goes one of my DS's, whoops. Oh dear, okay, uh... 
Yeah, I just knocked one of my DS's off of my desk and um, the capture boards on them are very fragile and I'm gonna cry if I broke it. Uh, okay. Well, that uh, that's not so good. Um, I mean, it's it's fine on the floor right now, I guess. I just hope it's gonna be able to be all right. Hey, how about that? Go nibby, new new splash. Wow, what a good move. <laughs> Do not come at me, woman. Wow, nebby, that's kind of mean. New is just acting like butters. New is getting hurt, nebby. Seeing that pain me just as much as I was always the one being hurt. But if I could become as strong as Helen, maybe things would be different. Maybe things could be. <laughs> you don't have enough badges to train me! But there's no badges in this region, Nebby! What do you mean? No! Hey, can I train you, Nebby, by the way? No, hello, Butters. It's been a while since we last met. There's a laboratory here that studies dimensions, did you know? Did you know? Did you know gaming? No, your trials must be trying to do three in a row. It was no problem, because I'm the master of the world. Yeah, I, it was super easy because I'm really good at Pokemon. Therefore, I had no issues with it, and I definitely didn't have a bunch of Pokemon die in them. Just just, just look at the last one. That that was what oh, they were like. They were super easy. All right, grab another totem sticker. Uh, grab another one of these. Big mushroom. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. And in we go. Da na na do 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 do. Wait, oh, let me let, let me go up. Yep, yeah, there we go. Did Lily go up without me? She literally walked into the place and she didn't even ask me if I was coming up. What a what a. How rude is that? How insanely rude is that? Ridiculous. Hey there, honey. What? Oh hi. I don't know what kind of voice to give you. Uh. What kind of voice can I give you? I don't know, man. I'm right. I need I need more female voices. Give me in the comments. Give me some like characters from a show or something to like in imitate. So I can I can I need more voices, dude. Mm, this year is Professor Burnett. She runs the Dimensional Research Lab. Yeah, she's also my husband. Dun dun dun. That's wild. What do what do I what do I give you? You're like Patters, right? And Lily told me about you. She said you were the reliable sort. Three months ago, I found Lily lying on a beach. She wasn't, she was, there was nothing wrong. She was just lying on a beach. So I, I, I picked her up and took her home. <laughs> How is doing his own thing? Maybe the real deal someday. He could even become Kakuna, just like old Hala before him. You really think so? Whoa, ho, whoa. Look at his eye. Look at Long Schlong's eyes. He's like actually surprised. Well, yeah, I really do. Good to see you again, Hal. It's been a while since I last saw you. Anywho, I brought Patters here because I wanted you to tell him about some of the mysterious phenomena here in Alola. I'd be happy to. The mysteries of Alola, huh? Then you've got to mean the Ultra Wormhole. Yeah. That's extremely rare, but sometimes a hole opens the sky over Alola. And it appears to uh, it appears that this rift leads to another an unknown dimension. The reason people think there are, are may, maybe a dim oh my god I can't talk I'm so sorry because the legend of fearsome Pokemon appearing from the Ultra Wormhole, like me, <laughs> says Cosmog. Yes, Cosmog, fearsome Ultra Beasts like you. There's also plenty of evidence in the Pokedex for the existence of different dimensions, right? I summon different dimension dragon! Fearsome Pokemon! Even normal wild Pokemon sometimes attack people, right? But the Pokemon that appeared from the Ultra Wormhole went way beyond that. You could say he went even further beyond. They were called Ultra Beasts and they were feared! The stories are to be believed, the guardian deities of the islands fought desperately against them. But like I said, it's all legends and folktales, it's hard to know how much is true. I would be happy if I could somehow unravel the mysteries of the Ultra Wormhole by studying the dimensional disturbances. We recorded several known relationships between Pokemon and different dimensions in books. You can find them on the bookshelves in this lab. Yeah, no thanks. I don't think I will. Uh, hey, Cosmog, what's up? Yes, Cosmog, like you. Uh, oh, totem sticker. Huh? Huh? Yeah, buddy. Nice. -oo. That's a nice. -oo. Okay. 
I don't think there's anything I really need to do. Oh, Lily wants to talk to me. You wanna know what happened three months ago? No, not really. I don't actually. Oh. <clears throat> she listened to my story, sing a ball night to you at all, then she even got her husband, Professor Longschlong, to lend me his lobster stain. She helped me investigate Nebby's origins too. Professor Burn has always been so kind. She's still helping me find a way to get Nebby back to its own home. Yeah, she's been like a real mother to. Aww. Well, isn't that cute? All right, time to go. How about that, Powders? The Ultra Beasts really are out there. I wonder what kind of moves they can use. Nah, probably just, you know, normal moves because the Pokemon universe would kind of collapse in on itself a little bit if they had anything different, you know? All right. Good luck. All of you is house past Diglett's Tunnels in Coney Coney City. Okay, I guess I'll just go and knock on our door and be like, yo, it's trial time. Let's go. Being able to go to more places really makes you feel like you're going along with your partner, Pokemon. It's pretty great. Yeah, shut up, Hal, you idiot. All right, let me leave real quick. It's time to go. It's time to leave. It's time for floor one. Here we go. Wow, that was... Well, elevators are just like theme park rides, except they're slower, but just as exciting. Uh-oh, it's time for the ultra... Uh, the, the ultra wormhole to open to the sky. Yeah, you can make a really easy joke about that, but I'm not going to because I am a high intellect individual. Therefore, I don't, don't make easy jokes. There you go. Hey, Peters, you made it through all the Captain's trials, yeah? Did you call me Kakuna Olivia? She lives in the town past Diglett's Tunnel. Diglett's Tunnel is, uh, it's near the PMC. I walk right past it. <laughs> now it's time for you to fuck up, you piece of shit. Wow, how is a really mad guy? But we're gonna go ahead and end this episode off here. Hopefully, you guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy it. If you did, please do destroy that like button right below this video. Thank you so much for watching, and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time.